Amsterdam was, I think, a beautiful city. I'll never forget seeing the Anne Frank house and hearing the story. You know, I learned about it in school, but it's not the same. It is heartbreaking, and I will tell you that as somebody whose family was profoundly affected by it, my mother lived through it, and it's important for the Anne Frank Museum to be there as a testament to how the human spirit can survive. And there aren't many survivors left. No. I didn't know about the stuff on the wall that Anne had pasted. It was interesting to see that you know, teenagers there at that time were like teenagers anywhere. They are reading movie magazines and keeping clippings of movie stars. Sort of humanized it. This photo of a Hollywood star in a room was just a wonderful, bright moment in an otherwise very, very sad existence. Yeah, or maybe just a little glimmer of hope for maybe one day, you know, we'll get out of here and we'll go and see Hollywood. And for those of you that uh, are out there and don't know much about it, go and find the diary of Anne Frank. It's in her words, a 13-year-old girl. Inspiring. Who didn't live long and it. You need to read her life story. It's happened many times in history. It happened not too long ago. It was my mother's generation and it'll happen again unless we do something about it. If we don't study history and learn by our mistakes, we are doomed to repeat it. It's important for you to find out more about it.